Hi everyone, this is Cheryl from Gemza. I wanted to share with you my second project for the Scraps of Color blog hop, um, Hot Fun in the Summertime. So this is day two, second project. Um, and I decided to do a layout um, this time. And um, this is coming from the paper that I use, the background paper, this one. Um, it's called the Summer Day Stack by DCWV. So it's this stack right here. Um, I got this stack at Joann's. I thought it would be fun to use for some projects for this blog hop. And um, let me take you through what I did. So I'm actually going to zoom in a little bit just because it makes it a little easier to see some of the things. Okay. So right here, these flowers right here, those are all Recollections flowers um, that come in the pack. Um, this title right here that says Summer Fun. That is um, cut out from one of the pieces in the uh, paper pack. And I just backed it onto some of the extra scraps because I used um, this paper for the third project that I'll be posting up tomorrow. Um, so I just used some of the scraps for that for this background piece here. This uh, mat that you see, it's um, a bunch of different layers. Uh oh, sorry, there we go, the camera's focusing. So there is yellow, green, purple, and white. Um, and this will hold a five by seven photo. The lawn chair that you see there, that is a sticker. Um, you see some flip flops down here at the bottom and this is actually um, only glued down at the bottom so that you'll actually be able to slide something behind there. Um, that's actually from the paper stack as well. And then the one fine day and then these flowers right here and all of this, that's part of actually the paper. Um, the only thing I did do to that one, sorry, I zoomed out instead of in, um, was I added a ribbon slider and then a, um, a flat back pearl. And that's kind of like in a yellow, a pale yellow color. And then this flower right here, this is actually um, part of those Calypso tins um, that Michaels used to sell or they still sell, I'm not really sure anymore. So it's just a bunch of different purple flowers um, held together with the brad in the center. And I just scrunched it up um, because I wanted it kind of like a, a scrunchy looking flower. And I think it turned out really cute. So um, that's my project, guys. Um, I hope you guys like it. Um, quick note about the uh, card that I made yesterday, the cup card. Um, I know a lot of you ladies liked it. Um, I love it, too. Um, and I know a couple of you said that you were going to be mailing them. Just a quick note, that card does not mail well. Um, you probably need to put it in a box or something because that vellum will crush. Um, you know, so you got to have something around it to keep it so that it won't crush down. I just wanted to let you guys know that. Um, I don't know if any of you guys realize that. If you did, sorry for giving you information you already know. But I just wanted to make sure that you guys knew that because I was thinking I would be able to mail it out too until I read... Um, this other lady uh, who um, did the card as well and posted instructions and she's a Stampin' Up! Um, instructor. And she said that that card does not mail well at all unless you, you know, totally enclose it so that it the cup itself doesn't crush. So again, this is my project. I hope you guys like it. And I will see you guys tomorrow for my last and final project. So thanks again. Bye-bye.